And demand for both COVID tests and vaccine boosters still remains high. But if you are looking to get either soon, you may have to wait a little bit. Channel 2's Jeff Preval is taking a look into the availability. If you're looking to get a COVID test right before Thanksgiving, you'll likely have to go with what's called a rapid antigen test, which are sold over the counter. And the advantage of antigen tests are that the results could come back quite quickly, sometimes as short as 15 to 30 minutes. Of course, the down with antigen tests is they're not quite as sensitive as the PCR tests. PCR tests, which are needed to cross into Canada, can take a day or two, perhaps longer, depending on where you go. These tests are the tests that have been most widely used. They are the most sensitive tests. At some of the major pharmacies, such as CVS and Walgreens, we did not find any COVID test appointments today. The only availability was later this week. There are always private testing agencies, but depending on where you go, you may have to pay if you don't have insurance. The Erie County Health Department also offers COVID tests. On booster shot availability, we found appointments a week from now at county sites, longer at some of the major pharmacies in the Buffalo area. The truth about the booster is that it doesn't need to happen immediately. If you schedule it a week from now or even two weeks from now, the important thing is get it on the calendar so that you can go ahead and be vaccinated. Medical experts say it takes some time for the booster shot to do its job. The booster shot starts to kick in after just a few days. However, your degree of protection continues to increase over the next few weeks to at least up to a month. Now, of course, we know that there's a lot of information out there on COVID testing and vaccine boosters. That's why we're going to put some links and some additional information in this story on our website, WGRC.com and on our app. In Buffalo, I'm Jeff Pavral, Channel 2 News.